Good day everyone, my name is Madge Blechnout, coming to you from Water Faith Christian Center in Kabecha with our Daily Blitz. And the scripture I want to read today is found in Isaiah chapter 40 from verse 29 to 31. And it says, He gives power to the weak and strength to the powerless. Even youths will become weak and tired, and young men will fall in exhaustion. But those who trust in the Lord will find new strength. Do you know that God actually expects us to be weak? He doesn't expect us to walk around strong warriors. He expects us to have moments of weakness. Did you ever find yourself spending time trying to solve a problem? and end up causing a bigger issue only then to find out you were wasting your time because that's, it was never your problem to solve. Have you ever been in that situation? And that of course leaves you tired, feeling weak and depleted. I remember a, a situation years ago, we were in ministry and one of my nephews, he was only two years old at the time and we were busy after church service, we were busy packing up equipment. And I saw this little two-year-old standing in front of a one of those huge speaker boxes. And this thing was probably 10 times his size and, and weighed, uh, you know, exaggeration, 100 times his weight. But it didn't stop this little two-year-old from standing there and pushing this box, pushing, putting, putting all his energy and effort trying to move this huge, big thing. And I looked at this because it's funny. It just looked funny. And then he eventually gives up and he turns to me and he says, I'm so tired, Auntie Madge. And I laughed at the time, but the Lord spoke to me and said to me, so many of us are walking around tired, depleted and feeling weak because we are trying to solve problems. We are trying to overcome situations that's not ours to sort and it's not ours to solve and overcome. And it leaves us weak. And then when you're feeling weak and depleted, you, we are so hard on ourselves because why am I feeling weak? And so the truth is when we try to do what's out of our control, just like that little two-year-old, we don't gain power, we lose strength and it leaves us weak. We're not supposed to be strong warriors walking around in control. So I wanna ask you, what are you busy with today? Does it leave you feeling weak and depleted? So being strong doesn't mean we never get weak. It means it's, it's, there's an exchange that happens. So we exchange our weakness for God's strength. So in those, so God wants us to be weak because it's in those moments that we can come to Him and we can say, Father, I'm feeling weak. Father, I can't anymore. And then that exchange happens and we gain His strength. And then, so the scripture says, but when we wait on God, our strength is renewed because we are not wasting energy, striving to do something we were never meant to do. So let's pray today. Father, I thank you for your grace, Lord, that even in the times that we feel weak and we feel depleted, Father, that you come and there's this great exchange that takes place, Lord. In our weakness, you come and strengthen us, Lord. So Father, I pray for all those that are feeling weak and tired today. I pray that you will come and strengthen them, Lord, that you will come and refresh them today in the name of Jesus. Thank you for your hand on their lives. Thank you that you are busy working it out on behalf of them in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you for joining me today and we will see you tomorrow morning with another Daily Blitz.